Hey Thomas, I'm sorry to do this to you right now, but at the moment you're one of the only people I can trust. The reason you haven't heard from me in over three months is it's because I've been branded a wanted fugitive. The people that are following me may already be following you, so we've got to be quick. Grab a bag, pack some things, and meet me at 3 47 181 39 in 38 hours. I need you to meet me there, and I really need your help. I'll see you soon. Good luck, my friend. Get down on your knees. Put your hands behind your head. Good morning, Mr. Grady. I'm sorry for the way that you were brought here. I did tell them to be gentle with you. All I want is for you to answer some very simple questions, and then you're free to go. Were you looking for your friend, Mr. Connor Demise? Do you know where he is? I don't know where he is. The file that we took from you today was sent to you by Connor. We can't access what's on the file, but my men claim that they saw a video playing as they entered your house. What's on the file? I don't know. How do we access what's on it? I don't know. Then why did he send it to you? I don't know. Why would he send me anything? Well, from what we've gathered, you two are very close, enlisted together in the 45th Regiment. From there, you spent three years in forward operations together. After that, you both went through special forces training and both qualified. But, only Connor went on to join. What happened, Thomas? Did something change your mind? Look, I'm going to get to the point. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but Connor is a wanted fugitive. He's been corrupted. We caught him trying to steal some very important documents, and it's in our interest and the interest of national security that we get those files back. Now, do you know where he is? I don't know. What is on the file? I don't know. How do we access what's I on the file? I don't know. Look, we are running on a very tight schedule right now. So I'm going to ask you one last time. Wait. Where is Connor Demise? What is on the file? Tell me! Thomas, get up, dude. We gotta go. We gotta go. Connor, what's going on? Who are these people? They said you were corrupted. I don't understand. I promise I'll tell you everything, but we need to get out of here first. Go on, get after them!
to see to it that he dies this time. You fool. Connor has manipulated you. He sits back while you take all the blame. Connor is dead. I know. So are any who cross this path. You'll be a wanted man for the rest of your life. If that's what it takes. You think you can justify yourself by some misplaced sense of self-righteousness? These people will drown without a firm hand to pick them up and keep them in line. It may not be morally right, but it's what has to be done. At too great a cost. Good evening. Breaking news has surfaced of a frightening conspiracy involving companies that have allegedly been inside our current government. Several people have been taken into custody today, including high-profile politicians and government officials. The leaked files were uploaded from an unknown source and authorities have yet to identify which individuals are responsible for the upload, but I think the population can agree we are very thankful. This has been Rebecca Eden for ABC One. Be sure to stay tuned for more updates.